At our focus, let's talk about the situation that remains tense at Delhi's borders as protesting farmers are continuing the march towards India's capital. The farmers have announced a nationwide strike today. It marks the fourth day of the Delhi Chalo March, which began on the 13th of February. Now, this comes after the third round of talks with the government in Chandigarh, which yielded no results. The next meeting has been scheduled for February 18th. The day-long strike today started at 6 a.m. and will go on till, the, till 4 in the evening. Now, emergency services like ambulances, pharmacies and schools will, however, remain unaffected. Now, owing to the national strike called by Farmers Union, the Gautam Buddh Nakar police in the state of Uttar Pradesh has issued restrictions. These include a ban on unauthorized public assemblies, political or religious, across the district and the use of private drones within a radius of one kilometer of the government offices. Barriers have been set up by the police on all borders of Delhi and the Uttar Pradesh city of Noida. Furthermore, the police said that the arrival of all types of goods vehicles will be restricted on the route from the Yamuna Expressway to Delhi via the Noida Greater Noida Expressway and from Sirsa to Surajpur via Parichok. Meanwhile, BKU leader Pavan Khatana said that farmers have been asked to strike work for one day in order to press the government for demands. This, as a section of traders in these areas, has urged the protesting farmers and the government to have a dialogue to quickly resolve the issue. Now, the ongoing protest is to press for the farmers' pending demands, including a law on minimum support price for crops and loan waivers. For more on this, our correspondent Dharam Jyot Kaur has sent us this report from the Ambala Chandigarh Highway. Listen to this. It is the third day of the farmers' protest here in India. We're currently in the state of Punjab at a key toll plaza which remains blocked by farmers as part of a nationwide strike that was called earlier today. It was a four-hour blockade in which farm unions across different states of India were blocking key highways and toll plazas. However, essential services like ambulances were allowed to pass through. As you can see around me, key meetings, rallies and gatherings are being held by several farm unions and their leaders. Now, the legal guarantee for minimum support Support price remains a contentious issue between the farm unions and the center. Three meetings so far and no conclusion has been reached yet. They've all been inconsequential so far. However, the center says that they've made good progress on the discussions. There is another meeting scheduled to be held on Sunday, February 18th, but it remains to be seen if at all both sides can reach common ground. With camera person Shekhar, this is Dharam Jodh Kaur for We On World is One. For all the latest news, download the We On app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.